It's really pretty awesome. My sweet ass rad motorcycle. Red exterior, two tires. It's got the a key hole on the gas tanks. I got the red jacket, red helmet, red bike. Billy, the salesman, let me in on a little secret. The color red, scientifically proven to trigger sexual feelings in women. So that's pretty good. That was just an extra 2200 Billy told me that this is the same exact engine as the F-14, which is the fighter jet that the, the U.S. Marines use. This part from the side kind of looks kind of like a frog's face, has eyeballs and a little mouth and stuff. A lot of this, you know, a lot of this it's hard for the layman to understand. I don't want to get too technical, but um, this right here is where the air goes for the tires. These are called cross-drilled dick brakes. Um, I don't know exactly why they call them dick brakes, but he was, he was pretty jazzed on that. That was an extra 2200 These are lights. It's got a, instead of a gas pedal, it has this thing. It's supposed to go like 385 miles an hour or something like that. So I'm looking forward to finding a place I can test that out. I don't know where the seatbelts are. I'm still figuring that out. They asked me, like, do you have any experience on a motorcycle? I was like, yeah. I don't. There's a way to get... They can store stuff down underneath the seat. There's a way to open it up. He did it at the place. If you just force it. I think you need to put a screwdriver in it or something. The helmet was specifically designed just for me, apparently. Uh, it's a custom thing. Billy, Billy, the guy down at the down at the shop, really hooked me up. All this aftermarket helmet stuff was like an extra thirty nine hundred bucks, but he was like super simple, just added onto the lease. I won't actually end up really even paying for it or something like that. Ah, okay, there we go. Can't really see. There you go. Now I can see. This isn't work. I think this glove's off. Something's wrong with this glove. Mmm. And these pancakes are amazing. See, the plan's already coming together. Are you eating them out of a bowl? How else do you keep the syrup from spilling?